It's become a common sight at Clearwater's on top of the world retirement community. Coyotes trotting across the fairway, in some cases even snatching up dogs. Boy, that coyote just come from right over in there to, uh, and just nabbed her. Dennis Batson says it attacked his dog Wiggles right on his back porch. It cost him and his wife thousands in vet bills and left them constantly concerned. Every owner here that has a dog, their lives have changed because we walk around with whistles and bells and baseball bats or golf clubs. We couldn't get a hold of management on a Sunday, but people who live here tell us the front office is even selling whistles and air horns to try to scare away the coyotes. There was a coyote at the end of his leash six feet away from him. The problem has become the talk of on top of the world. Just about every small dog owner we spoke to has a story about a coyote encounter. Well, for God's sake, I, I just bought a joint here three years ago. I didn't, I didn't sign up for no packs of coyotes. Neighbors are tired of walking their dogs in fear and say no matter who they complain to, the problem isn't getting fixed. Well, they should do something. Why would you wait until someone got hurt? And FWC tells us removing coyotes doesn't work, so the agency teaches people how to coexist with them. They say coyotes are timid and will usually run away if you scare them.